my lovely Sophia here, Psychic Tarot Reader, Personal Mentor. Welcome to my channel, Sophia Psychic Tarot. So today's daily guidance is for the 5th of November. So let's see what comes out today. Again, if it only helps one person, then my job here is done. It's not going to um, be relevant to everybody. Okay, so we have Don't Let Pride Get In Your Way. and connect with nature you're rejuvenated and inspired by spending time outdoors let's come to one of these and ten of pentacles so I am going to sort of put it all together at the end like I normally do. Let's come to um, a romance angel. Um, calling in your soulmate. Your prayers, affirmations and visualisations help bring you together. I know a lot of you are doing those techniques that I've got in the Get Them Back playlist to get your person back. So carry on, my lovelies. And explore your options. Dear God, thank you for your wisdom and love, helping me see, understand and assess all of my alternative options. Please guide me in the best direction for my health, happiness and life's purpose. And I'm going to end with one of these. And creation. Which goes very well with that one. So. Spirit is saying here. Just telling me which way to put it down. Okay, regarding your happiness, if you like, feeling secure, your ten of pentacles. Okay, regarding what you want, whether it is secure relationship, job, family life, home, whatever. Okay, don't let pride get in your way. Again, don't cut your nose off to spite your face. If you feel too overwhelmed that you um, you, you know, your head is going to burst or your emotions are too raw, then go for a walk in nature. You're rejuvenated and inspired by spending time outdoors. And, you know, like I said earlier in the week, I think it came out, might have been in another reading, but, um, you know, whenever that card comes out, um, what I've done is go for a walk. I'm lucky I've got the woods next to me. OK, or even if I just go and have a cup of tea outside just to sort of take in and reconnect to nature, taking in the wonders of the earth. OK, and regrounding myself, if you like. Sometimes I'll say when I when I come back, the answers will be there for me. And, and sometimes they are. They just sort of magically appear. So don't let your pride get in the way stopping you from getting what you want because you can have be and do anything remember okay so again for those of you who want to join the vip facebook group it is a paid fee but that does include it's, it works out to five pound a week where there's a live questions and answers um talk that i will do to help you get what you want in your life or person that you want in your life lots of little challenges lots of sort of interaction so it's like sort of mini version of my um, mentoring if you like so go to the community page to see more details of that a lot of you are sort of inquiring but it, there is a fee okay because it is um it works out a lot cheaper than my mentoring course but obviously it's not going to be as packed as my mentoring course but it's hands-on help to keep you motivated to get in what you want okay so we have here explore your options 
Please guide me in the best direction for my health, happiness and life's purpose. So that's not saying if you were um, wanting a specific person or wanting a particular job or house that you have to go and explore your options elsewhere because you can't have that house. That house isn't right for you. No, if you desire something or someone, it is yours until you don't desire it anymore. Okay, so explore your options as to how you can not let pride get in the way, not get over emotional, not overthink in a negative way. Just take time out to breathe, okay, and carry on calling in the thing you want, whether a person or whatever else it is, with your affirmations, prayers for those of you who are prayers, because when you say your, your words, um, whether you're thinking them or saying them, whether in a prayer or affirmations or whatever, are spoken energy. Okay, so there's no different if you're affirming, you know, I have this beautiful relationship to dear God or dear angels or dear whoever, please can I have this perfect relationship, okay? The thing is, when you are saying, please can I have, it's sort of delaying it. Where you're saying affirmations like, I have my perfect relationship, we're so happy together, or I have my perfect house, job, money, whatever, okay? Um, it's tricking your mind, which doesn't know what's real or not real, that you already have it, okay? If you're saying, I want, I want, please, I wish, okay, you're pushing it away, if you like, Where you're, whereas if you're saying, even if you can't feel confident to say, and I have a video on affirmations, and our formations in the um, Get Them Back playlist, even if you're saying why, why do I have this beautiful relationship? Your brain can't block that as much as a um, I am statement, if you're not confident to claim that it's already happened, okay? But I, that's a whole different video. So your prayers, affirmations, and visualizations help bring you together. Creation. Create what it is that you want in your life. We are all natural manifestors. We've been doing that since we were small. You cannot not think. And there's another video why your thoughts create. Because if you are your dominant thoughts or your opposing thoughts to what you want are negative. My person doesn't love me. I'm never going to get that job. I'm not good enough. I never have any money. Then that's what you're going to see. When you change it to what you do want, you will get what you want. I am a mighty creator. It is my birthright to create. You can create your own destiny. Be industrious. Every creature on earth creates. You should welcome the process of creation. Okay? Because we are natural. We, we are always manifesting. Unconsciously. It's when we realise we can consciously manifest a beautiful life and people in it that we want that we fuck it up, basically. Because we start to become impatient or we start to feel needy and desperate, okay? So, again, create, my lovelies. You can have your beautiful ten of pentacles, your security in whatever it is. But just don't get caught up in your negatives or letting pride get in the way thinking that you can't have it, thinking that your person or somebody else has to change the situation for you. No, you are the creator of your reality. And again, lots of videos in the Get Them Back playlist and please come and join me in my Facebook VIP group. Again, details in the community page. I'll leave this with you. Love and light.